Here in the Wind River Range in Wyoming, one animal contends for special awe. The moose derives its name from an Algonquin word, musu, meaning he strips. Here, the regal female traverses a lake where she... <sighs> Can't we use a different take? The female traverses the lake. Oh, oh! Glaciers and snowmelt off the high peaks feed the Wind River, which. Oh, come on! Oh, God! Oh, it's. Oh, it's very, very cold! We've been doing a volunteer vacations project, which is where people spend their vacations doing, uh, like, work with the Forest Service. Like, uh, there was this part of the trail where it got really muddy and marshy from flooding and stuff, and. The horses and mules and llamas were having a hard time getting through there so uh, we like dug out an area and put in some stones so that now people can pass through there without having to muck through the marsh and that means the trail goes uninterrupted for a pretty long time oh it's cool oh icky toes climbing up on the hike here you know you it's it's really hard but then once you sit down and take a break and you just look at the view. It's just all you just you just stand there at all at it. Well, for me personally, it's great to get away from my BlackBerry for the week. I'm not, not kidding. We, minutes, we saw right? Sasquatch feet in the river today. Then you can tell. Me. It wasn't. Have fun with it. <laughs> I think it was bear. Jones. It was a baby Sasquatch. Okay, take over. Let me. It's been a lot more work than than I anticipated. <laughs> uh, lifting rocks and cutting down trees, but it's. It, yeah. It's, uh, it's a lot of fun. By the time you leave, you, you, it seems like a pretty close family. You get that sense of accomplishment. You know, at the end of every day, you're typically walking away, seeing what you've completed for that day. The only thing I like more than chopping wood is filming myself chop wood so I can watch it later. Oh, there we go. <laughs>